Hey everybody, welcome back. Uh, this is Joshua Jericho. I guess I don't want to welcome back. Welcome to <laughs> Jericho Plays Final Fantasy IV. This is Joshua Jericho, of course. This is Final Fantasy IV that I'm playing. And currently, I am kind of like... I don't know what the term for it is. Like, lost in the basement sewers of... It's like the underground passageway on our way to infiltrate Baron and try to save our waifu Rosa. Who knows what else? I don't even know what else is going on. There's so much going on right now. At this point, if you haven't been keeping up, uh, you're in trouble. Because a lot of stuff has happened in the last couple episodes. We lost everybody, then we found some people. And <clears throat> we're a paladin now. Cecil has turned into a paladin. And I have Palin and Forum. Tella, and now I got Yang back. We're just all over the place. <clears throat> Sorry, pardon me. Anything back here? Okay. And we. I, went into this cave thinking it was just going to be like a quick little cave thing and it's actually more of a like labyrinth with all these hidden passages and stuff which is cool but I wasn't prepared for it So the plan right now, basically, in the long and short of it, is to try to, uh, oops, basically to try to clear this out and get into Baron. I'm sipping on my Black Label Mountain Dew as we play today, because I needed a little kick. Usually I drink water, but... <clears throat> As you can likely tell, my throat's a little out of it, and I am a little under the weather, just slightly under the weather. I've been, I have been for a little bit, but we're doing okay. Don't worry. I got my Mountain Dew, I got my Final Fantasy, I'm in a good mood. We got this thing done. Probably should heal. I forgot he automatically covers. Why do I even have cover on there when I'm playing? I'm not healing nearly enough. I should be healing way more, considering I have a healer in my team. Spider silk, what's that for? I don't even remember. Oh, cast well. Yeah. There's a lot of items like that in this game that are just like, it's kind of cool that they have those game or have those in the game, but to be totally honest, most, I know I don't, but I think most people don't even bother to use them most of the time, you know? Like, it's just kind of go, you kind of go, eh. Maybe once in a while for bosses. Yay. 
Again, I should probably be curing. I don't know why I keep putting her on defend. It's just so much quicker and easier and like brainless to just put everybody on defend real quick. I should really be remembering to heal with her more often. Okay, so now I need to go this way. Oh boy. This is definitely a labyrinth kind of dungeon here. And have her heal this time. Okay, let's see. So since I was talking about Black Label Mountain Dew, I'll just go ahead and have a little fun here talking about Mountain Dew. It is my favorite drink. I love Mountain Dew. Um, I try to control myself, but I can't. I like the Black Label, it's fine. I like... What I like to do is... I like... Okay, so Pitch Black is my favorite, and I'm really glad it's going to be around now. So that's my favorite. But what I usually like to do is I usually go with regular Mountain Dew, um, for the most part, and then I'll just get, like, Code Red or Pitch Black or the Black Label or something on the side and drink that every once in a while in between Mountain Dew, kind of just to, like, variate the flavor a little bit. But uh, I love Mountain Dew. Like, or, um, Livewire, Code Red. I don't like all of the papers, but I like a lot of them. Must be super fast or whatever. Oh, two headed snake guys. Yay! That one wasn't as tricky as some of that ones. I'm gonna guess from this one. I'm gonna go up this way first for probably like a save or treasure or something. Ooh, treasure and a save. Mmm. Gatch Deliatus. Ooh, Ancient Sword. <clears throat> I want to guess that's uh, equipment for Cecil, because, well, it's a sword. Element Holy may inflict curse status. Is that good? It seems lower. I must. Maybe there are things that are like strong against holy, and I'll maybe need to switch it out, but that doesn't seem like an upgrade right now. Probably should use a tent. Everybody's kind of low on stuff. Oh man, I'm gonna be so broke for tents in a while. Good to save though, considering I really hadn't saved like since I got to Baron. Now that I think about it, because you don't kind of have a spot in Baron to save, they just kind of throw you right into the dungeon here. What? Why is he there? Bar. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> 
Yeah, having counter on this is awesome. They actually have done something really great in this that I can tell is that Cecil is much stronger as a paladin than he was as a dark knight. Like, you get much stronger eventually, but you don't really know how much stronger because... But eventually you catch up with where you used to be. But from level 1 on, he has definitely felt much, much stronger as a paladin than he did as a Dark Knight even, so that's been kind of nice. Because that is not how it used to be. You felt really weak when you first became a paladin in the old style. That's kind of nice that they updated that. I want to say there's treasures down here someplace, but I don't remember where. I could be remembering wrong, I don't know. <clears throat> it seems like I am. Is this the dungeon? There's nobody here. I wonder if I can get to my room. The tower that I just like randomly have a tower and kind of like mine. Which seems weird. This tower here. This is my tower. Oh, and I used the tent. Oh, well. I'm trying to remember. I don't think if I should say what I'm trying to remember now. I know there are events that take place in Baron Tower or Baron. I'm trying to remember if this is the last time I'm going to be here or not. That's the crux of it. Nobody's home, which is actually pretty creepy. Lord Cecil! You're alive! Vigan, tell me you've not joined him too. Him? Gobetz. I am the captain of His Majesty's Royal Guard, Cecil. My loyalty belongs to Baron Mal Hazabeth. Forgive me then. I've heard that Sid is being held here. Is it true? I fear it is. I led my men here in hopes of rescuing him, but only I survived. I see. Do you come with us then? Your blade would be most welcome. Consider it yours, my lord. But there's no room for him in the party. What is it? Something stinks. I smell it too. A monster stench. What? Be on your guard, my lord. Hm. 
His acting stinks too. You would expect him to try a little harder to fool us, wouldn't you? So you have gone over. Why must you keep accusing me of being some kind of traitor? I'm merely repaying a great man for the wonderful gift he gave me. Behold! <clears throat> Uh-oh. Oh yeah, the gift of snake arms. I totally understand that one. <clears throat> oh man. Apparently you have to hit all the arms. Ow! We definitely got some kick. Oh no. Um, for the moment. What's going on? people and dang old snake arms white magic she have raised yet? Yes, she has raised. Uh, kick. Attack. There's so many debuffs on me now, I don't even know what's going on. I would say this fight is not going well.
Why did Palom just suddenly die? I'm dead and I can't do anything about it. Palom back there. Why did he even die? I don't understand what's going on. I'm just getting stomped, and I don't even know what happened. Does that count as a win? That was horrible and ugly. I have no idea what happened. And I completely wasted a phoenix down, and I still cannot get Palom back up. I don't understand. God, what an awful fight. I am sorry, guys. I screwed that one up all over because I have no idea what was going on. You shouldn't be so quick to trust people. Even Feigen. Yeah, that was pretty ugly, but... I think on that note, since we got through the fight, somehow, I will go ahead and stop here and then I'll probably run back and sleep, is what I think I'll do, and sleep in the bed and get everybody back, because that did not go well. <laughs> but thank you for watching me be a terrible combatant in that, and I will catch you guys next time. Thanks for watching.